back, having uh, Cody back, that really helped. I didn't want to really play Chris past 20 and didn't want to play Cody past 14 or 15, uh, but they were able to get on the floor and get some running because they have not gotten a lot of run in uh, since they've been out. So all that said, um, I thought we really showed some improvement in a lot of areas and that was good. And now we've got 10 days to get ready for the opening of our season. So we're excited to give the guys a day off tomorrow and then uh, get after it Monday, have a full week uh, of practice and preparation for PFW. You have a nickname for Moses yet? <laughs> Not yet, but you, you get a taste of just watching him. You know, he's, he's special. Um, I think what makes Mo so special is a couple things, but one, he really wants to be good. I mean, he really wants to be good. So that's first and foremost. But it's 7-2 with his wingspan, um, and he's got, he, he's got a physique that he's not thin. He, it, there's nothing weak about Mo. So having a, a thick body at 7-2 that can move the way he can move, several times tonight he had block shots at one end, and he's at the rim first at the other end. And you just don't see a lot of guys 7-2 that can move like that. And I think that's what makes Mo special. Coach, about a week and a half ago, you talked about David Singleton saying I was a knockdown shooter tonight, four for four from three, two for two from the line. What do you, is this basically in line with what you saw? Yeah, and then, you know, I haven't been able to look at all this, but then uh, four assists to the Eagle turnovers. So, you know, losing Tiger uh, for the season, uh, we've had to kind of see how that was going to work as who could give Jalen a blow here or there and, and play a backup. And David, over the last week, has really grown. And he played it in high school. Uh, and the thing I like about David, he, he cares about doing right. So he's not a guy that forces a lot of things. He just makes really good basketball plays. And, you know, tonight he was, he was really good. No turnovers, four assists, makes all of his shots. Uh, he can really extend defenses, which is going to be good for us. Uh, and we can play him with Jalen as well. Uh, so I think there's been some good growth with what he's been able to do in the last week, playing a different position. Looks like there wasn't much of a drop off, if any, with the second unit. Well, and, you know, I, I, a week ago we were so banged up that with Cody and Chris out, it was hard to even practice. So I, I like the reps we've gotten in the last five to six days. Uh, and then this was a good scrimmage for us just to give guys minutes and going up and down. And I told them at halftime, I, I thought a huge key to the, the first half was what our, uh, the, the second flow of guys that came in did a very good job defensively. Uh, and that's huge uh, for us because especially with two or three of those guys being really young, if we can do things like that, and, and again, that's what the exhibition season's for. We're trying to find kind of what, what matchups on the floor work best for us. But uh, I liked how the starters started, and I really liked how that next wave came in, uh, and there was no tiring, there was no fatiguing, there was um, a lot of energy, especially defensively. I thought uh, where we improved tonight is we, we turned some people over, and that's what we've got to be able to do. And, uh, and we took care of the ball. And those were two things I didn't think we did a very good job in our scrimmage. So how did you think Jalen Hansen said really seven assists, Really good. Really you good. Know, I, I thought he took good shots, 15-7-7, um, seven seven, one turnover. <clears throat> you know, Jay can have you know, a four-to-one assist turnover ratio. That's tremendous. So yeah, tonight he was seven, seven to one. So I thought he did a very good job just running the show and, and running his team. And, we need for him to shoot the ball because he's a good shooter. So I thought he did a good job of picking and choosing when he shot and when he should pass. And that was good. When you look at how the shots were distributed, I thought he did a good job of making sure he got everybody involved. Anything else for Coach? All right, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it.